for that. All right, that's just gonna slip in right there. Now this is locked. As difficult as it is to admit, I am just not very good at setting up my trailer onto the truck. It's always been kind of a hassle of moving the car a little bit more forward, a little bit more backward, and I refer to the car because I have a Camaro on a flatbed trailer, and uh, roughly about 6,000 pounds total. So I know I want 10% of the load on the hitch itself, but it's always just a guessing game on it. And I've used the traditional two inch regular drop. And uh, thanks to the fine folks at Waysafe, I now have a four inch adjustable drop with a gauge built into it. So now once I take into consideration my payload and the trailer, I can go ahead and load up the trailer, set it onto the truck, see where we're at, make sure that I'm correctly set up on there. And then I can uh, calculate how much I'm throwing into the bed and have my total payload. I can have a safe trailer that's not going to sway down the road because I've got it set up. And uh, I just now we can eliminate the whole moving the car forward and backwards, guessing, stepping back, looking at it. But let's take a closer look at, to the, at the way safe hitch right here. Here's how it comes as, uh, as shown here. This is all the pieces that we've got right here. Right here, 10 to 15% is what we want. Uh, gross trailer weight onto the tongue. And uh, yeah, in fact, they have an app right there where you can calculate everything. You can input all your details. I have not completed this. This is super cool though, and I cannot wait to complete it. And then it gives you all the basic info of what you're looking for, your target, and how much you can have. This is awesome. That's an awesome addition to it. And that was free of charge with this. It uh, right there, just scan me, and boom, we're in. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Oh, you know what? I wanna point out, available in black Cerakote aluminum. That is a spectacular looking unit right there as well. But I opted for just the straight up aluminum. And this is a heavy, high quality unit right here. I mean, look at this, look at the finish on that. So we pull this pin out, we can swap out to a different ball. So the kit that I have is a two and five sixteenths, as well as, there the standard two inch ball. So the two and five sixteenths is gonna be my go-to because that's just, that's what I use. But this is just a phenomenal looking unit. I mean, they're local here in Utah, so that is super sweet too. But uh, important safety information right there. I thought that came out, but it doesn't. But take a look at that gauge. That's pretty cool, huh? So it just it weighs it based off of, I don't know, some sorcery right there. But yeah, it's um, this will just push down. Let's see if we... It moved, right? I don't know. I guess I'm not very strong with the thumb. So I'm going to set this aside. I don't even know where to put it. We're just going to put it right there. Very well boxed. This is not going to get damaged by shipping at all. Look at that, four inch drop, fully adjustable. You got two different lengths to choose from if you need to be for or aft on uh, installation here. <clears throat> so right there, the label says uh, waysafe.com, obviously V5 rated 1500 pounds tongue weight, 12,500 pounds gross trailer weight. That's huge. So I got the max tow package on my 23 Silverado and uh, that says I can tow up to 13,000 pounds. So the cool thing is, this is gonna handle that. If we did do 13,000 pounds and we put 1,300 pounds of tongue weight on there, this is going to hold it. You know what I'm gonna do here? Since I have this from earlier, this is just my two inch drop with a 6,000 pound capacity. So this, uh, this new one from Waysafe absolutely destroys that guy. All right, set this over. Again, don't know where to set things. So I went all in on this. I wanted everything, and I thought this is super neat. Let me cut this open, and we'll go into the locks. All right, so we have a rubber cover. We have some keys. There's our little pin lock and some keys. This is gonna be magical if all these keys are the same. All right, so that set of keys right there. 
Oh yeah, key to like, I love it. Look at all these keys I have now. That is, uh, that is superb. Super happy that those all match. Well, wait, there's more. Let's see if this is key to like as well. We're looking keys. Oh yeah, everything is key to like. That is just convenient right there. So now with the whole kit, I have six keys. Let me take that back. We have eight keys. So we're definitely not losing anything on this, that's for sure. That is a nice lock right there. All right, so I'm going to assemble this and um, we'll go into that. Here it is all set up. What we've got is the pin goes inside here, right? The pin comes out so the ball can be easily switched out for whichever one you're using. And in my case, we want the two and five sixteenths. Look how nice that is. I just cannot believe that. Okay, let me see here. Let's try to do this so you can see. Pin goes right in, sits flush. So it's gonna be covered up. And here's our four inch adjustment. And now, uh, if you're wondering why I went with a four inch adjustable, it's because my truck is factory hyped right now, but I plan on putting in two inch lift blocks and uh, that's gonna go with my upgrade package that I'm doing on the suspension, different video. But um, if right now I'm using the two inch, this is gonna be what I, I use in the factory setup. And when I put the block in, I may need a three inch drop, I may need a four inch drop and this is going to give me that. So now with that pin right there, we're going to slide this guy in and we're just going to go like in the middle. This is tough to hold and try to show on the camera, but we're doing it. All right. So here's our lock for that. All right. That's just going to slip in right there. Now this is locked. That's it. So if we want to make an adjustment real quick, just a simple key, unlock it, slides out. I guess I'll show you because if I'm gonna talk about it, we gotta show it, right? Slides out and then uh, we can make an adjustment. Oh, we need to go a little bit higher right there. I can just pull the key out, push it in. We are locked in right there just like that. How cool is that? So now we've got the, the lock, set this up. We've got a nice little padlock right here. And we've got the lock for the lever and um, Nice little cover right here for weather. Oh, dang. That is cool. That is super cool. I'm gonna throw this on the truck and see what it looks like. All right, we've got all of our parts here. Got it set on uh, roughly the two inch drop down right there. Again, all adjustable. that we are locked in place I'm telling you I'm a big fan of the matching keys right there look at that